Actor Mark Rylance won an Academy Award this past week for his role as a Russian spy in Steven Spielberg's Oscar-nominated Bridge of Spies. Rylance plays alongside Tom Hanks, who portrayed James Donovan, a lawyer from the Bronx who has ties here in the Adirondacks. The family of the real-life movie hero was in Lake Placid recently for a special screening of the film. Our Jack LaDuke has more. It came up at the last minute. I have offices in London. These clients, not my idea. Scotland is fishing. The acclaimed motion picture takes place when the U.S. and Russian armies had their fingers on the nuclear triggers during the Cold War. The movie takes place at that edgy time and is called Bridge of Spies, starring Tom Hanks as James Donovan, an American hero who defended a high place Russian spy. Uncle Sam wanted him to represent the secret agent in court. They wanted a fair trial. But Donovan was skeptical about the request at first. The Soviet spy they caught, we want you to defend him. Here's the indictment. I'm an insurance lawyer. I'm not sure I want to pick that up. Representing the spy brought retribution to Donovan's family. Angry Americans shunned the family, labeling them communist and worse. Bricks were definitely thrown in the building. They, the kids were greeted by picketers every day. After the trial, the American government wanted to exchange Abel for imprisoned Gary Powers. The American U-2 spy plane pilot shot down photographing Russian installations. Where do they want this negotiation? East Berlin. Is there any outcome here where I'm not either detained or shot? Cold War Berlin was a long ways from Donovan's lifelong summer ring in Lake Placid. He met and married his wife Mary there. The Donovans adopted Lake Placid as their home away from home. Recently, family members gathered at the Olympic Village for a special screening at the Palace Theater and a discussion about the Oscar-winning film. I basically have been waiting my whole life for this to happen. Uh, growing up, listening to my grandmother tell, tell us all about this, you know, the, the fact that MGM was to have made this movie. And, um, she, you know, I'd hear her once in a while saying, oh, I wrote a letter to Robert Redford letter to this person and you know nothing ever came of it and then a biography was published about him in 2005 I believe. Spielberg uh, arranged to have breakfast with you, the family. Did. What was that like? He's, he's a lovely person. Um, he's an incredible historian and storyteller. He was so interested in what Arab conversation and was like a kid in a candy store, truly listening to our mother and uh, her sister and brother talk about their dad. John Donovan ran a highly successful insurance claims business in New York City. Although he had no spy training, he was a skilled negotiator, allowing him to get the release of U-2 plane pilot for the release of one Russian spy. In the book, you can really hear our grandfather's voice and his humor. and. Beth and I have talked about where sure Tom Hanks read the book um, and got a very accurate, um, you know, sense of, of what he was like as a person. Both James Donovan and his wife, Mary, are buried here in Lake Placid in St. Agnes Cemetery. For Mountain Lake Journal, I'm Jack LeDuc in Lake Placid.